Welcome to an out of the box unboxing. Today I'm going to be looking at a card game called Trust Me I'm a Doctor. It's by Half Monster Games from Brisbane. Um, three to eight players, which is a bit different from my usual game, 15 and above. Um, it was funded on Kickstarter, but I didn't see it on Kickstarter. Um, I picked this up from Bold Games. So um, I know very little about it. So um, let's have a look. Ooh, looks like it's got an interesting cover. Let's have a look and see what's inside. I think there's a another one of this in this kind of series called Trust Me I'm a Super If I like this, I might pick that one up as well. Box. Oh, okay. I knew there was a hinge. Oh, okay. Well, that's cute. So you've got like an apothecary. Um, that is a really nice box. I, did, I didn't expect that. So two sets of cards. Oh. Yeah, that is. Really nice. Insert. I'm a little bit. They look pretty tight. I think there's no chance they're going to fit in the sleeves. So I reckon the insert's going to be history. But we'll worry about that when we get there. Cures. Oh, I said, look, there seems to be a lot of cards. It says, you say how many cards we get? Nope. Guess I'll have to count them. Look about standard size cards. Okay. What have we got? So we've got a rule card. And what do we try that for size? Um, standard magic sleeve. So what are those? Yeah. 34 by 88. So yeah, that fits in nicely. But um, get back in the box. Ah. chance they're not going to fit sleeved so either insert goes or you get some very or you just don't bother sleeving them depends how much shuffling there was i guess okay so what we got here so rule card two so there's two cards rules um and then we've got ailment sin criminality hysteria Pistol wound. Oh, okay, so the other side. Oh, okay, so we've got cures and ailments. Cards are nice card stock. Bit thinner than a magic card, but look fine. Ailments. Okay, so these are all the different ailments, and they look like we've got psychology, potion, maybe surgery icons. They're all very um, gruesome. Boy. Very um, kind of historical images. Tomfoolery. Um, yeah. Less said about that one, the better. Okay, so we've got ailments, and then we've got. Oh, skull drilling. <laughs> it does say it's um, 15 plus, so um, yeah, that's power of prayer. Amputation, needles, bloodletting, withdrawal of blood from a patient to prevent or cure illness or disease. Okay, oh, okay so they've got symbols as well. Um, I guess it's a match the symbols type game. Let's see what we get in this one. A lot of cards. Okay. What have I got in this pile? So there are ailments. These are cures. There's a lot of cures. A lot of 
binoculars. Oh, quarterization. Burning away pus, raw flesh and corruption with white hot blades tempered in fire. Yes, this does dung juices. This is almost like a historical um review of horrendous doctoring maggots. Ural analysis. Taste texture. Your money. All help diagnose every ailment ever. Flagellation. Okay, so yeah. Not modern science. Anyway, okay, so there's a whole pile of cures, whole pile of ailments. Um, there's rules. I will read through those in due course. Um, so if you're into, it's not really medieval, it's more um, 18th century, 17th, 18th century um, medical history, this could be a fun one for you. Um, I do like the case. I think that's, that hingedness is really cute. Um, the cards themselves, attractive, great images. Um, Have a play and see whether I can adapt any single play rules. Otherwise, um, yeah, all fits nicely back in the box. That is, trust me, I'm a doctor.